Now, as soon as you've got a problem going on here, the laws of physics state that you then have to have a problem going on above and below to compensate. So, in addition to that, which gave us short left lateral flexors here, and again, we're not going to test your muscles, origins, insertions, and nerve innovations, we're just going to glump them together. Short left lateral flexors, and therefore short right rotators. The left scapula protracted, it actually started to stick out, and it came away from the wall of the rib cage. And in addition to that, the left shoulder joint, the head of the humerus, shot forwards. Okay, so what that gave us was a decreased shoulder girdle stability down this side. The internal rotators of the rotator cuff were tight because they were pulling us forward along with pec major 